and welcome to my weekly tutorial. My name is Karin, I'm from Extraordinary Fitness, and today we are going to work on Gazelle, Extreme Gazelle, and some easier version of this kind of split on the hoop. You saw it before on the video, so now I will explain it to you. So, first of all, come into the hoop and decide which leg is going to be the leg which is in the front. So my leg will be the left leg, so I will turn the hoop, and there is the first thing, which is really important. When you are going to lay back, you have to see that you are um, in the middle almost with the hoop. So if you are too much behind the hoop and you want to do this position, you will get your leg blocked on the hoop, and it means you will never really get your leg over. If you would be too far on that side, you would almost feel like you fall over. So it is really about in the middle. So you turn the hoop, and you're going to go with your arms around and lean backwards. The easiest version will be if you take the leg, which will be, I call it your front leg, you almost can go, depending on the size of the hoop, a little bit over. So you're a little bit further on this side of the hoop. You're going to lean back and you're putting the, out, the inside of the knee on the outside of your hoop. Again, fix yourself in the right position so you feel you have enough um, on this side of the hoop, enough of your body, and then you lean back, you place your knee there, you push the knee into the hoop, really press it into the hoop, you can bend your other knee, and you can let go. If you want, you straighten this leg, and if this feels good, you grab the leg here, and you pull it as well. This is one version. I would say, Train the one with the knee on the hoop and really press the inside of the knee to the outside of the hoop. If you feel that this one is still a little bit tricky, let me just come back to you. <laughs> you can use your hand and it will look like this. Again, so get your knee towards the hoop. Go with your same side hand, like the leg which is in the front, around from the outside, around your knee and grab the hoop like this. So you can choose yourself if you want to have a cup grip, which is thumb down, fingers around, or if you want to have a normal grip, which is thumbs up, finger towards you. Again, you can bend or straighten the back leg. You can bend this leg, and you are holding. And then what you can do is for either you actively straighten your leg, which will give you active flexibility, or you grab your leg and you start to pull it down. So I would say this is the easiest version. What you do in all the time, no matter if you have your leg here only or if you grab it with your hand, your other leg is also as well kind of pushing against the hoop. And when you bend it, it might feel safer in the beginning because you feel like you can also push down a little bit and towards the side so to get the stability. So it's kind of your uh, with both legs pushing against the hoop to keep it in that line. The extreme, the extreme gazelle, same thing again, turn around, straighten your leg, take your knee to this hoop, slide down, grab your leg, slide down, so you're hanging down there. And then what you would do is that this hand is basically doing a circle over down, going around, you are bending your back foot, you grab your ankle or your toes in the beginning, but try to go to grab your uh, ankle or gin, and then you pull it down. So you pull here, I'm pulling downwards, and I'm pulling my front leg all, as well down. So both legs are being pulled down. And then go up with the first hand, release the other hand, and come back. Yeah. So one more thing which you should really think about, especially in the extreme gazelle, but also in the other ones, is the knee of your back leg. So when you are um, in the split and you have your leg here, you are bending it. What you really have to think is that you're pushing this leg down and activating your glutes really to get your heel as close as possible towards the hand which is going to catch it. I'm going to show it to you one more time. So first you can have your leg straight. You take the other leg over. You grab your foot here. And now what might happen is that your leg will go up and then you will never reach it. So what you have to think is that you are really, like once you have your leg here, you bend your leg, you push it down, and you bend it as much as you can so you really reach it. 
and then you come back. So this is really important. Think about pushing this leg down into the hook and bend as much as you can, activate your glutes so you can grab your foot better. So I think that's often a, a difficult part where the people, uh, the knee is slowly sliding up and then you won't have a chance to grab it. So really think about opening it active, pulling, pushing down. This would be all the kind of splits and gazelle versions. Give it a try. Let me know how your try went. If you have any question, you can send me an email. You can join the Facebook group, extraordinary.fitness, and post your video there and ask me questions. And subscribe to my YouTube channel and see you next Wednesday for a new tutorial. Bye. Thanks for watching.